Need some coins for that God Squad you've always wanted? For fast and the cheapest coins anywhere, make sure you guys check out MMOEXP.com and use code ZERK for 5% off your order. Link is in the description. The whole thing wobbing. What's going on guys? It's Zerks coming at you today with another YouTube video and today we've got quite a bit to talk about this morning. There's really two topics that I want to touch on. Last night there was an 86 overall Zach Ertz on the auction house. I'm getting a ton of tweets about it. Nobody knows what the card is actually about. I know a little bit of info about it. Not a ton. But we're going to talk about that. And then also we are going to talk about the max mutt level or in general the level grinding bands that are going around. And I say bands in quotations because I, there may be a little bit more to it. So there is a little bit to discuss with that. Maybe some workarounds for it potentially. But I just have a lot of info. We're going to talk about that because I've seen a whole lot of comments about people saying, oh, don't do level grinding. You can get banned. I'm gonna kind of go around how I did my mutt levels, which may be different from the people that are actually getting banned for doing mutt levels. And we don't even know 100% if that is the case because Kralo says otherwise, but we'll talk about that. Now, I do need to give a shout out to Troy Brock for being a part of the Nota Gang. If you guys want a chance to be shout out in the next video, drop a like in the vid. Make sure you guys are subs to the channel, turn notification bell on, and comment down below, Nota Gang. Also, guys, we should be having, like, maybe some more reveals today for the Superstar promo. I don't know when the Superstar MVP promo is going to be dropping. It could be. Last year, it was actually 8 p.m. before the game dropped, so... At 8 p.m. tonight, it could drop. Maybe at 10 p.m. Could be at midnight with the standard edition release. Or it could be tomorrow during the day. I'm not exactly sure when that's going to be happening. But also over on Xerxes 2, make sure you guys check out over there. Did just do a Devin Hester gameplay. And George Kittle gameplay is coming out later. And also, I am currently giving away an Xbox Series S. If you guys want to enter for that giveaway, all you guys are going to do, drop a like in the vid, make sure you sub the channel, turn the notification bell on, and comment down below the secret word on this video and every video because on August 25th, I'm going to pick a random video that I upload from the 12th to the 25th. So the secret word for this video, we'll go with coffee. So comment down below, coffee, leave a way to contact you up for Twitter or Instagram. Let's go over Zach Hertz, then we'll talk about the bands. All right, so I'm recording this part of the video at like 1 a.m. right now because I already know I definitely want to cover this in the morning. But this somehow, some way, got sent out to people. So I've been getting tweeted nonstop about this card. I checked my DMs, and someone actually DM'd me and showed me that they actually got two of these 86 overall Zach Ertz. Now, what is this card? I have no idea. It doesn't have card art. It doesn't say anything. It says clean slate base players. But you guys can see it is on the auction house. I'm going to show you stats as well. But... The person actually DM'd me and said that he reached out to EA Help, that is loyalty stuff, which I have not gotten my loyalty stuff yet. I'm guessing we're probably going to get them Friday. Uh, we got a rookie premieres. That's just kind of what I've thought this entire time. If we don't get them then, then I would contact EA Help, or I will contact EA Help with my loyalty stuff there. But I guess he contacted them, and also others contacted EA Help about getting their loyalty stuff, which, of course, if you guys know, it's that pack where it gives you, like, the 82 overall and AT players. Well, he said these Ertz that are actually in the auction house weren't his, but he saw more on the auction house. So it looks like somehow, some way, EA sent out 86 overall Zach Ertz. But I don't know what this card was supposed to be. So somehow EA sent out a bunch of these cards to people when they asked for their loyalty stuff. It's got 81 speed, 85 excel, 91 short, 86 medium. It's got pretty good run blocking and catching stats. 91 catch traffic, 89 spec catch. It's just really slow. He's got 81 speed, 85 acceleration, 99 injury, okay, 78 jumping, and 93 catching. Does he have any, like, he's got zero change of direction. He's got a 65 truck. This card is just so weird. Like, I actually have no clue. Number one, how did they send this card out, right? It, like, it has to be in the game somewhere. Number two, if it had to be in the game, what was it supposed to be? And then also the stats obviously aren't right. Zero change of direction. Like, that's, that's definitely not right. I have a feeling maybe, and this is just complete, like, complete guess here, okay? Maybe Zach Ertz was supposed to be an 86 overall superstar card. And somehow they sent them out to people trying to get their loyalty stuff on accident. But the stats are incorrect. Because that zero change of direction doesn't make sense. The rest of the stats honestly are 
kind of makes sense, but I feel like are pretty high for an 86 overall. Yes, his speed's low. Yes, his run block is low. But the route running and catching stats, I'm not sure if that all adds up there to 86 overall. That seems a little bit high. So, I don't know. You guys, let me down below. Did EA somehow leak a card? Like, was this supposed to be a superstar card that's going to come out uh, tomorrow or later tonight, whatever, when the superstar MVP promo does drop? Will it still come out? I'm curious to see maybe if EA does go ahead and reveal more superstar cards and Zachary's 86 overall is one of them and he has similar stats. I don't know. This is one of the oddest things I've seen in a while. All right, so that was Zach Ertz. I'm not even really sure what to say about that, but that was interesting to say the least, right? I mean, I don't understand how he messed that one up or what that card is supposed to be. But now let's talk about the Mutt Level Bands. So number one, I'm going to hop on over to Twitter and showcase something for you guys because Kralo was in a Twitch chat yesterday. A lot of people were asking him about the bands, whatever. I don't know what stream he was actually in. But he stopped by a stream and he said this. So this is a tweet from Marksman who screenshotted this and tweeted it out. So Kralo did say, but we looked into it. However, if people believe something someone follows, you can't change that judgment. Which pretty much means that if people are getting banned for doing something other than just normal level grinding, just grinding out the level solos, doing whatever they're doing there, then they say they got banned for level grinding. People are going to believe that. And then you can see it does say, but no bans for level grinding at this time. So Kralo did say there are no bans for level grinding. But I've also got a lot of tweets from people saying I've only been level grinding. I didn't do anything wrong. I literally just level grinded and I got banned. But I know also there are people who have been getting banned who have been using bots to level grind. There are bots you guys can use to level grind. Do not do it, of course. But there are bots you can use to level grind where people can pretty much set up a bot on PC. Uh, I don't, and maybe on console as well, where you guys can go into the solo and it'll run like a script uh, and just basically go through and it'll play the solo for you. And you can go to bed and it'll just do all the levels for you. So the issue is with that and why I see why people are getting banned if they're botting is because obviously EA's system is going has bot detection, right? So when you're playing solos, they can detect if you literally have the same exact pace for 10, 12, 15, 20, 30 hours at a time, it looks like your body. Also though, Xbox support tweeted this out, which this is very interesting here, but Xbox support last night tweeted out, we're aware that some users may be seeing incorrect in-game currency balances on their account and may also appear to have incorrectly received suspensions from some games. I've never heard of that before from an actual like Xbox issue. That just seems, that just seems kind of weird. So Xbox support tweeted that out. I know one person slaying, uh, I've been talking to him a little bit. He's only like mutt level 15 and he got banned, but we don't exactly know why he got banned because obviously yes, he was level grinding a little bit, but not even that much. And he is on Xbox. So this may potentially be the issue for him. We don't really know what's going on with him. But also, there are people on PlayStation who have gotten banned for level grinding, as they say. So obviously, this does not sound good. And this is not good at all, of course, if you are level grinding. Because Prelo said there's no banning for level grinding, right? Yet, there are people who are saying they're level grinding, they're doing it legitly and they're getting banned. Well, I have a theory here as to why they may have been getting banned for level grinding because Kralo did say there's no ban for level grinding. However, kind of my idea that I have, and this is not confirmed, I mean, literally, I could be completely wrong, but I am maximum level 50, and you guys know this, every single year, whenever a new mutt level comes out, if you guys are new to the channel, you probably don't know this, but if you're not new to the channel, every single year, just like last year, whenever a new series would come around, we get new mutt levels in the game, I'm grinding them out instantly. Day one, boom, I'm on them, I'm playing solos over and over and over again. But there is something that I do differently that I think a lot of people probably don't do. And this is probably just because I am a content creator. So when I go through and you guys go take a look at my maximum level video, right? You'll notice that I back out of my solos very frequently about every 45 minutes an hour i back out of my solo challenges whereas someone who is you know not a content creator they may sit there for you know throw on some youtube videos throw on a tv show whatever you may sit there for three four five six plus hours of just kicking field goals or throwing passes and just spamming the same button over and over and over again without ever backing out i think that maybe, and again, this is not confirmed, just my theory here, I think maybe that EA's bot detection 
that's a little bit flawed right now and they definitely need to work on that and I think people that are sitting there and doing it for four or five, six hours in a row and keeping the same pace, kicking field goals, where it looks like they're botting because they are just sitting there doing the same thing without ever backing out, without ever stopping at all, without ever changing pace, EA is detecting that as a bot. I don't want to make this video to scare you guys and get you to stop level grinding because obviously I want you to get your levels done as fast as you can and I showed you guys how to actually do it the fast way in previous videos as well. But, a little recommendation, and I can't guarantee this will not get you in trouble, but as I said, Kralo said, there are no bans for level grinding. I am at level 50, I have not received a warning or a ban or anything, but maybe you want to do what I did. So when you go into these solos, play through the solos, every level takes about 40 minutes, 45 minutes, which is why I was backing out every 45 minutes to an hour, to obviously showcase the rewards for you guys, and then I would just go on to do the next level. I recommend you do that. I would recommend if you guys are going to level grind, Go through, maybe play the same solo for about an hour, and then back out. Back out, take a look at the rewards that you guys got, maybe do something else just so the system can register, okay, he's changing pace, he's not a bot. And again, this is not a way for me to guarantee you guys don't get banned for level grinding, but Kralos said there are no bans, but yet people are saying they're getting banned for it. So just a recommendation, play your solos, but maybe back out every 45 minutes, an hour, if you're doing the same solo over and over again. So that way EA can see, okay, he's not botting because a bot script is not going to back out. That being said, guys, that is the news that I have for you guys today. Make sure you guys check out all the videos that I have going up today. Uh, and as I said, Xerxes 2, I will be having George Kittle gameplay up later today. And also tonight, maybe... We'll have the Superstar promo at midnight or a little bit before, or it'll be tomorrow. So we're going to have a Superstar promo. A lot of fun stuff with that. So hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. And if you did, make sure you guys drop a like in the video. And of course, hit that sub button down below. I'll see you guys next time.